So you have been doing guitars for how long? This is year number eight. Year number eight. Well, I've certainly seen your, your guitars around, and uh, they're certainly elegant looking. Sort of remind me of the swan of guitars. Ah, uh, yeah, man got, with true style. That's right. They've got the long neck, and they're very graceful. And uh, so tell us a little bit about uh, your, the favorite guitar that you brought to the show today. My favorite is not one of the 27s. My favorite guitar here is one of the, the new Gosling guitars, which is now the big little offspring of the Swan. It's our first 25 and a half inch scale guitar. 25 and a half inch, so this is not a long scale this guitar. This is not a long scale Normal guitar. scale length. Normal scale, people have been bugging me for a normal scale length guitar since we first began. Uh -huh. And I finally decided it was time to give in and give the public what they want. Uh, so we built a batch of three 25 and a half inch guitars, and I am absolutely thrilled with them. Fantastic. Well, show, show us one of them. Gosling number one. This was it. This was the first one we did. It's a one piece maple top, one piece swamp ash back, maple neck with a Coco Bolo fingerboard. The pickups are a pair of prototype DiMarzio Firebird style uh -huh. humbuckers. Let's, let's get it. Let's get in a little closer on that. In addition to the usual neck, both bridge setting, right. it also has a series mode by pulling up on that switch. Okay. So Jim, this guitar is one piece on the front and the back. And the back. And, and that must contribute a lot to really good resonance, right? Well, I'm not convinced that one piece uh, wood actually contributes to resonance. What I am convinced is that it looks very elegant. Uh -huh. And more importantly to me, it, it looks very natural. Mm -hmm. I, I, I really wanted the wood to flow. If you look at most book-matched guitars, if you look at the tops, the tops look almost manufactured. Mm -hmm. Whereas with this, it feels more like what you would expect to see in a tree. Being from Oregon, trees are very important to us. We like trees. You tree hugger, you. We're I bet you eat granola too, huh? It's absolutely. Oh boy. Okay. All right. <laughs> I'm just giving you a hard time. Who doesn't like trees? I mean, you know, it's not like there's this global warming. Th oh, wait a minute, there is. Okay, so tell us more. So <laughs> we've got you've got these DiMarzio that are prototype pickups. They are, and it's it's interesting because I, w I was using these Firebird pickups that Jason Lawler makes. Also wonderful pickups. And I got a call from Steve Blucher at DiMarzio, who's a good friend of mine, uh -huh. telling me that he had just built a set of look-alike pickups, also Firebird style pickups. Uh -huh that would fit the same mounts, and he built them for another builder who was building guitars for Brad Paisley. Uh -huh. Did I want to try a pair? Brad Paisley, oh, he'll never make it. Yeah. Anyways. <laughs> so he sent me a pair of these pickups, and in fact, Brad had rejected the bridge pickup, which I thought was perfect for us, but he loved the neck pickup. Uh, he thought the bridge pickup was too warm and too fat and not spanky enough, and I thought it was just warm enough and fat enough and spanky enough for us. And we're using them both in our 27-inch scale length guitar and our 25 and a half. We're also using the Lawler Firebird pickups, which are much spankier and much brighter. I see. What your friend is now. What is the difference? Uh, I know the difference is smaller, uh, but what is the difference tonally when you when you jump around? Or what are the other considerations for 25 right. versus 27? The, the 27, because what you're doing is you're taking a piece of string and you're just simply pulling it further. Okay. So what you're doing is you're putting more tension on it, which means that, that it's going to snap much more quickly. Just think of a rubber band. You, if you pull a rubber band tight and then thwack it, it's going to go much more quickly to maximum velocity. Yes. So. The response of the 27-inch guitar is much faster. Wow. You're getting this very tight sound. You're getting a lot of clarity, note to note. You get this articulation that you cannot get with a 25 and a half inch scaling, no matter what. It makes Pickups sense. won't make, won't get you there. No electronics will get you there. Tension on the strings is really the game. The game, and it's not. You can't even get there by putting on a heavier string, because. It is the combination of the more the additional tension over the longer length right. that gives you that very fast response. So it feels like the note is jumping off the guitar. Yeah, it is very responsive. So how do they get in touch with you? Do you, do you, do you sell through dealers or do you sell no, direct? I sell direct. They can go to www.soloayguitars.com and 
Two L's. S -O one L. One L. Like solo way. S -O solo way. Okay, very important. Oh, yeah, I know what you we'll have to flash that across yeah. the screen then. That's right. Scale, I want and they're, they're more than happy to give me a call at area code 503-977-2727. I will always be willing to talk guitars to anybody. I love talking guitars. Well, we can tell, and it shows in what you're building. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Nice